Bayron's trying to do his digging thing and Diego's biting him at the same time. I'm trying to convince Diego that I opened the gate here. Diego, you want to come out? Come here. See, I'm standing here. The gate's not here. Come on. Diego. Come here. Come here. You can come through. Come on. See? It's open. I opened it. There you go. Just don't get into any trouble. grass is always greener. He's got a tub of his own water, but this looks better probably. Here comes a warrior. Diego. Diego. He can't come through the fence. Don't worry. I'm going go in there. He's going to check out the corral. Watch that fence. Just don't go through the fence because Warrior's a tyrant and we don't want you on his side. Although he looks like he's fallen asleep this morning, huh, Warrior? He did have a narcolepsy attack a little while ago. Now he's semi-awake. Well, Bayron and Lucky don't seem to be concerned at all that they have a friend out here. That's good. You can stay out for a couple of hours and then we'll bring you in for lunch. Watch that fence. Warrior, you look like you're sleepwalking today. Buddy, I don't have anything. I don't have anything. No, I don't. You have two acres out here and you're going to hang out by the fence and make me nervous. It was cold last night. Now that the sun's out, everybody's half asleep, I think, warming up and feeling good. Well, all this walking will do him good. comes trouble. Trouble in her boyfriend.
That feel good, Diego? Everybody's getting old over here, Penny. I'm not after you, Bayron. It's okay. It's okay, Diego. Diego says, I'll come and run back to mommy. Look at you, Trot. Not bad. It's okay. He's not going to hurt you. Well, all this walking in his hoof boots is just what he needs to rehabilitate his feet. He's really trucking this morning. All right, yeah. Here he comes. Don't run me over. impressed with these easy boot clouds. They're working very well. And those two are cranky. Don't go near them. Sorry, but you are, both of you. This is what you need to be doing, running. Running! Is the Bayron chasing you? I don't think so. I think he's just trying to play. You okay, Diego? I know. You're afraid of other horses because you haven't ever lived with any. They won't hurt you. They're okay. These are the nice horses that you're out with. He's gonna go back for more. Why not? He's looking for trouble. Diego.
Lucky's gonna come down here and look and see if you have any breakfast left, even though everybody's got hay all over the place. Jeez, he's full of it. Don't overdo it, crazy horse. Diego. It's okay, Lucky. You're turning into a wild man, Diego. Good grief. Take it easy on those feet. Apparently you're feeling a lot better, huh? You could hardly walk two weeks ago. Now look at you. Don't go near my food, Lucky. It's okay. Maybe we should close him in since he's getting so wild. You have to go out though, Lucky. Go ahead. Now I can get some work done. Okay, you stay in here. Go out again tomorrow. He's getting a little too hyper. Be good. It's okay. His instinct tells him he wants to be with other horses, but since he's not been with other horses for 20 years, he gets scared and a little hyper about things. I think he had enough adventures for one day.